Hello, hello everyone. Look who I'm with. I am here with our Bella and Paddington F2B English Cream Mini Golden Doodle Babies. And this is their very first video. They're three weeks old now. And look at them. Look at these babies. Look at those beautiful, beautiful coats. Um, this English line is just hard to describe. Their coats are magnificently soft and it's a uh, non-shedding, but most of them are going to be this soft cotton wavy coat. Now you'll see here burgundy and purple um, look a little more curly and that may not actually be a curly coat. It is a cotton coat, but it may have some curl or not. We're just gonna have to wait here and, and see. Um, I'm gonna go through everybody here so you can see everybody up close. And then I'll just tell you a little bit about what we're doing this week. This is little purple girl. And she is what we call a peanut butter color. Now, this is my daughter, Jessica, picking everybody up. I'm actually sitting on the bench. So yeah, sorry about the legs and everything. Here is burgundy girl. And she, we're gonna watch here. She's gonna be um, closer to the, the cream color. You can kind of see her shimmer there. And then um, compared to turquoise color girl here, she is a darker peanut butter color. And we'll just keep watching them. Remember, they're just three weeks old, so we need to watch them a little longer to see if they're gonna lighten up, um, be a little darker. But what you're seeing right now is pretty typical of their mature colors. Here we have Lavender Girl. So we have the purple and the lavender. Lavender has just a little bit of curl here and she is um, another peanut butter color. Just keep in mind that curl may not actually be a curly. It's definitely not a fleece or the thicker coat. Here is Light Pink Collar Girl. <laughs> and she is a very light peanut butter. We'll watch and see if she turns more into an apricot color. And we have lime green here, one of the creams. Look at her, look at her. And look at how that, that um, coat kind of has what I call a shimmer, where when the sun uh, uh, shines on it, it kind of has this glistening effect to it. So she's one of the creams. Oh, and burgundy was, was definitely a cream here. Can you see the, yeah, the creaminess? <laughs> we'll have a second look. Second look at her. Everybody, this is what we do at three weeks. The first video is just everybody just kind of sleeping. Here we have dark pink collar. So in this litter, we have dark pink, light pink. Um, dark pink is another kind of um, creamy, more apricot color. We'll just watch her here over the next two weeks to get her true coloring. She's not a dark peanut butter. All right, so we only have three boys. There are eight girls, three boys. Little Orangey here is a peanut butter color and he is the smallest of the entire litter. He is gonna probably mature a little smaller than 20 pounds. So um, he's, he's definitely a little guy. Black collar, black collar boy is one of the creams and another wavy coat. So other than um, the three that I mentioned that, that have a little bit of curliness, everybody else is going to be just that wavy coat. And here we have Red Collar Boy. He is a very, very light peanut butter color. So he may end up being more of an apricot. We'll kind of watch him. Soft cotton wavy coat, <laughs> look at him. So just the three boys, eight girls, three boys. Um, lots of girls this time around. So I know that those wanting a girl, you have a lot of choices. Um, look, turning everybody around so you can kind of see them. Um, I understand that they're all cute. Every single one of these is gonna be absolutely gorgeous. Um, but cute only goes so far. You want to make sure that you have a good match for you, your family, any other pets that you have. So that's why we do our temperament testing at five weeks. We want to make sure that you get all the information along with the videos and pictures to make the perfect choice for your family. And of course, I am here for any, any questions. Um, you can definitely see here the difference in the 
dark peanut butters or what we call a light red um, versus the creams. Look, there you've got a dark and a cream side by side there so you can kind of see and get a better feel. <laughs> so with the English cream, they have more of a, what I call a blocky face. Um, and one of the ways we get this blocky face in both the girls and the boys is um, Bella, which is our English cream golden doodle. Her daddy is actually the English cream, the white English cream golden retriever in this line. That's Bison, her daddy. And her mama was Brie. Um, that gives us uh, having the daddy as the white English cream um, is, is the, the male is the one that gives us that high blocky face. So when, if you get a boy, you're gonna notice more of the square blocky face, but we still have that in some of the girls too. So there's just a little different look to them, more of a distinguished regal look to them. And of course, if you watch my videos for a, a while here, you know that I have a little special place in my heart for Bella puppies. They just are incredibly gentle laid back um their mama is just the sweetest most laid back girl ever they're also incredibly smart so that's why this litter tends to be a favorite um, for therapy and service especially in our veteran um, ptsd owners um, there's just something kind of a sixth sense that they have they can feel the owners um, and sorry, just poor Jessa. She's learning the camera here, learning the camera. She <laughs> keeps putting her finger in front. She's cute. Um, they just kind of have this sixth sense. They can sense your moods. And so that tends to be one of the favorites there. Of course, we, Paddington is, is the sire here and he's a sire of a lot of our litters. Um, so we, we raise all of our puppies the same. So we get a lot of the same, um, you know, socializing demeanor, things like that. But uh, when it comes to the English creams, especially Bella's litter, they um, you'll notice with Bella's, as they mature and we do their grown-up videos, there's 11 puppies here. She always has a large litter between um, 11 and 12, or I'm sorry, 10 and 12. Um, and you'll notice they're just not as energetic, running around as everybody else. Of course, this is different. This is their first video, three weeks, they're just gonna sleep. But as they get older, you're gonna notice a difference from these, or between these babies and some of our others. Um, they're just more laid back, which, you know, I totally love. Case in point here, here's Jessica with Little Purple Girl just chillaxing. Um, this is a short video this week. They're not doing much but laying and sleeping. So next week we'll go over a little more of what we're gonna be doing with them over the next few weeks. And as they move around more, you'll be able to see those personalities. Okay guys, have a good weekend.